There's nothing more quintessentially British than having afternoon tea. And the two sandwiches you'll always find on the menu are smoked salmon and cream cheese, and of course, a cucumber sandwich. So I'm gonna give them a will twist and bring them straight up to date. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna whip our cream cheese. Just lightens it a little bit, gives it a bit of a different texture. I'm just gonna add a little bit of salt and pepper into there as well. Just gonna let that whip away into there. So whilst that's whipping, we can get on with flavoring our two butters. I've got a pack of butter that I've just had softening away in the microwave, 10 seconds, and then just kind of mold it around so you get a really pliable texture and it's nice and fluffy and nice and soft, just like that. For our smoked salmon butter, we're gonna add some fresh uh, lemon zest into there and then we can mix that together and that's a very, very simple lemon butter. And then we've got our second little batch of butter as well. And with this one, we're gonna add yuzu. Now this is a Japanese citrus fruit that's kind of a cross between a lemon, a grapefruit and a lime. And you get a lovely earthiness from it as well as it getting a lovely citrus kick from it. Again, a little bit of salt and pepper just to season it. And already just by mixing that, I'm really starting to smell that lovely yuzu flavor. And then just to give that a little bit of a crunch and a nice little texture, we're just gonna take some fresh chives and we're gonna finally shred them to go into our butter. We give that a good mix. Now what we need to do is do something a little bit different with the cucumber. So I've got some cider vinegar and this is just gonna gently pickle. So we're just gonna place a little bit of our cider vinegar in there. And with our cucumber, we just wanna take the outer skin off and then what we can do, we take nice wafer thin pieces of cucumber. And what we can do is we can place that into our cider vinegar. Now we don't wanna leave this in here too long because it will become over pickled. And then we take it out. Now we can start to build our sandwiches. Some slices of white bread. We've got our yuzu and chive butter. And then taking our little pickled bits of cucumber, overlapping it slightly really is as simple as that. We pop the top on. Now, of course, an afternoon tea sandwich can't come with crusts. Then, of course, it's into fingers to go on your lovely little delicate tea stand. You can do exactly the same with our smoked salmon. So with this time, we've got our brown bread, and now we've got our lemon and black pepper butter. Just a little bit, and you can see the lovely little flecks of lemon zest, that when you bite through that, you're gonna get the creaminess of the salmon, the cheese, you're gonna get that lovely freshness from the butter. And then, oh, there's nothing quite like the sound of a quiet kitchen when the mixer stopped. You see how light and fluffy it is? Place a little bit of that. And then we've got our lovely smoked salmon here, and this will just get draped across. I'll top it on. Again, we can slice up the edges. It's cream cheese sandwiches. Now, of course, very classically, these afternoon teas will be served with scones, with clotted cream and jam and lovely selections of tea, maybe a glass of champagne even. And those are probably what you would call the ultimate afternoon tea sandwiches.